please stand for our national anthem performed by Heaven Brooks, class of 2022. So proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glow. Bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was still there. Oh, say, does that star spangled banner yet wave for the land of the free and the home? Thank you. Please be seated.
Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the 135th commencement ceremony of Wyandotte High School. Buenas noches, señoras y señores, y bienvenidos a la ceremonia de graduación número 135 de la preparatoria Wyandotte. I am Mary Stewart, principal of Wyandotte High School. At this time, it is my pleasure to introduce our platform dignitaries. To my right, Dr. Valdinia Wynn, member of the Board of Education, Unified School District 500. <laughs> Dr. Anna Stubblefield, superintendent of schools, Unified School District 500. Dr. LaShonda Bilbo Irvin, Instructional Improvement Officer for High Schools, Unified School District 500. The Honorable Tyrone Garner, Mayor CEO, Unified Government of Wyandotte County in Kansas City, Kansas, and 1987 graduate of Wyandotte High School. Also participating in tonight's ceremony will be the Wyandotte High School administrators, Ms. Jan Davis, Ms. Anna Barnes, Mrs. Megan Betrez, Mr. Rufus Black, and Dr. Mylan Rivette. And Wyandotte teachers to my left, Mr. Salvador Gavalda, Mrs. Leslie Hanzelka, and Mrs. Carmen Lajam. Also assisting this evening is our interpreter, Sitlali Orozco. <laughs> Surrounding the graduates on the floor are Wyandotte High School teachers, counselors, and support staff. Would all Wyandotte staff members please stand? <laughs> Thank you for your support and commitment to the class of 2022. Gracias, maestros, consejeros y personal de apoyo de Wyandotte. I also wish to recognize as our special guests this evening the parents, families, mentors, and supporters of the class of 2022. Congratulations to you. Los padres, familiares, mentores y simpatizantes de la clase del 2022 son nuestros invitados especiales esta noche. Gracias por todo lo que hacen y han hecho para apoyar a la clase del 2022. The class of 2022 has chosen as its motto, breaking through adversity during these uncertain times. La clase del 2022 ha elegido su lema, superando la adversidad durante estos tiempos inciertos. Class Valdictorian Jimenez, Jimenez Martinez de Angel and Class Salutatorian Maria Duran Garcia will share their reflections on this topic. Good afternoon. Before I begin, let me give my thanks to my mom, who's been my number one supporter all of my life. Gracias, mami, por trabajar tanto para sacarnos adelante. Y gracias por todo lo que has hecho para que yo pueda estar en este escenario. I'd also like to thank one of my teachers. She gave me some encouragement when I really needed it back when I first started high school. And without her help, I might have graduated a year later. So thank you, Ms. Metcalf. <laughs> and thank you to all the other school staff and friends who have helped me along the way. <laughs> now we've all faced difficulties attending online classes. All of us may have a different perspective 
on the time that we spent in quarantine. Some of us may have loved it, some of us may have hated it, and some of us may have deeply struggled because of it, or may still be struggle, struggling because of its effects. Yet, regardless of your perspective on it, we have all been brought together by this collective experience. From what I've seen, one of the main struggles for all of us was finding the motivation to do things, finding the motivation to do our work, to show up to school, maybe even procrastinating on things that we enjoy. Everyone has, in some way, put the effort to be here, even if you don't feel like you did. But remember, graduating means that you've accomplished something, and it shows that you have the dedication. As we... <laughs> As we move on after high school, we will surely, once again, meet these kinds of personal struggles. With ourselves, at where we lack motivation to do things that we need to do. Just remember that we have an obligation to ourselves and to others. All of us are gonna go down different paths, going to college, into the military, into the workforce, or into technical schools. All of us are going to be experiencing vastly different lives, but if we all reflect on ourselves and how each of us has pushed through personal struggles, we know that we've done it before and that we can do it again. We are equipped to overcome challenges that we may face. So here's to our families and to us, the class of 2022. Because once a bulldog, Thank you. Hello, class of 2022. My name is Maria Duran. I want to start my speech by first thanking God, mi mamá y mi papá, mi novio Ángel, mis hermanas, mis suegros, and all of the school staff that helped me endure the four years of high school. Lord knows I wouldn't be here without the support of any of you, so thank you so much. In the words of Rocky Balboa, it ain't about how hard you hit, it's about how hard you can get hit and keep, and keep moving forward, how much you can take and keep moving forward, that's how winning is done. If anyone knows how hard life can hit, it's a class of 2022. We've learned the hard way that life can throw punches when we least expect it. During the four years of high school, we've been through many character building moments, one of them being the transition from middle school to high school, where we had to adapt to a whole new environment that would help us grow as individuals. Along the way, we experienced friendships and heartbreaks that would help us mold into the people we are today. As a collective group, we have also been uprooted from normality and thrown into the uncertainty of the pandemic. The pandemic was a difficult period of our lives where many students struggled with their mental health, isolation, and the new realm of online school. Inclusively, some students have lost family members, friends, and loved ones during these past four years. But despite those hardships and adversities, we are here today celebrating this beautiful milestone in our lives. Class of 2022, Look around you and contemplate your surroundings. Today is a day that we have been anticipating since we stepped foot into Wyandotte High. Please give a round of applause to the class of 2022. The Honorable Tyrone Gardner is Mayor CEO of the Unified Government of Wyandotte County in Kansas City, Kansas. He is a 1987 graduate of Wyandotte High School, a U.S. Army veteran, and has served our community in the Kansas City, Kansas Police Department for over three decades, attaining the ranks of Captain, Major, and ultimately Deputy Chief. We welcome him this evening to address our graduating class. Damos la bienvenida al alcalde Tyrone Garner, quien le dirá unas palabras a nuestra clase de graduados. Good evening. Come on now, good evening. Aren't we happy tonight? Aren't we proud of the Bulldogs? Bulldogs. Wyandotte. 
I took you back to 1987. <laughs> For those of you who remember that. We are so proud of you all. And it, it's just amazing. It just seems like yesterday that I was graduating back in 1987. And I'm not just proud of you. This community is proud of you. We're proud of your accomplishments, along with your family, your loved ones, and your friends. What you've done is something really great. The first step to hope, the second step to opportunity, and the third step to an improved destiny starts with an education. You've taken that first step. Let's give it up for the class of 2022 Wyandotte High School. I'd like to give a formal greetings to all our graduates, all the staff, Dr. Stubberfield, uh, Dr. Stewart, um, our board members um, that are here today, as well as all the family, friends, and loved ones, but more importantly, our graduates. On behalf of the Unified Government of Wyandotte County, Kansas City, Kansas, I offer you sincere congratulations on this commitment. Each of you have worked really hard to earn this high school diploma, and we salute you. Celebrate this achievement with the understanding that you are now prepared with the education you have received to attend college, trade school, or to begin a career in whatever path you choose to take. And whatever that path is, please understand that Wyandotte County is home for you. We want you to anchor yourself here and come back because I need you as your mayor to help make Wyandotte County a great and safe place to live, work, and raise your family. Let's clap to that. I'm a living testament of graduating from USD 500 in what Wyandotte County uh, Public High School, specifically Wyandotte High School means. There are no limitations. Don't let anybody tell you that you can't. You've been equipped and God has given you everything you need to be successful in life. If people tell you can't, show them that you will. If people say you won't, show them that you did. Don't let anybody deter you. The only failure in life is the failures you set up for yourself. Don't let anybody stop you. Don't let anybody hold you back. Every one of you is equipped and every one of you is great. Take that greatness out into your life. Give life your best and let your best always reflect excellence. God bless every one of you. I wish you the best in life. Go Bulldogs. What did you say? Once a Bulldog, what? All right. Members of the class of 2022 have received a number of awards, medals, and trophies in athletics, extracurricular, and academic areas. The Wyandotte administrators will recognize our academic elite. Nineteen seniors are members of the National Honor Society, whose membership is determined on the basis of scholarship, character, leadership, and service. Will the members of the Wyandotte High School chapter of the National Honor Society please stand and be recognized? Congratulations to all of the National Honor Society members. Thank you, you may be seated. There are 67 seniors that have stretched their learning above and beyond basic requirements. They have earned, that they have earned them the honor of being called Kansas Regent Scholars. These students have completed graduation requirements for the district, have earned credit in chemistry and physics, have completed two years of study in a foreign language, as well as the rigor of an advanced math course. Will the Kansas Regent Scholars please stand? Congratulations to these students for their outstanding achievement. Thank you, you may be seated. A number of students have challenged themselves and enrolled in classes beyond the district requirements. 
They have earned college credit hours while in attendance at Wyandotte High School from Kansas City, Kansas Community College. Will those students who took the challenge and enrolled in college classes please stand and be recognized? Congra congratulations. Thank you. You may be seated. We have another group of students who have chose to enhance their education and attend the Technical Education Center at Kansas City, Kansas Community College, also earning college credit and many earning industry-approved certificates. Will those students who attended classes at Tech please stand and be recognized? Congratulations, and thank you, you may be seated. Two seniors have committed to serve our country by enlisting in one of the branches of the United States Armed Forces. As I read your names, please stand and be recognized. Harlan Carter, who is committed to the United States Marine Corps, and Jonathan Ritz May Stay. Please stand. Who will also be serving in the United States Marine Corps. Congratulations. There are seniors in our group who have worked tirelessly filling out scholarship applications, requesting letters for recommendations, and filling out requirements to earn scholarships. As of 9 a.m. this morning, this class has earned scholarship monies totaling $70,785,990. Will those members, will those members of the class of 2022 who have been awarded scholarships please stand and be recognized? Congratulations. Thank you, and you may be seated. The most distinguished honors are those bestowed upon the students who rank among the top of their graduating class based on their cumulative grade point average from seven semesters. That's from the first semester of grade nine through the first semester of the senior year. The title of cum laude signifies a distinguished level academic achievement. Each of these members of the class of 2022 have earned a cumulative GPA between 3.8 and up to 4.0. Congratulations to our cum laude honorees who will stand as their names are called. Graduating cum laude are Judith Diaz Saragosa, <laughs> Parmisa Parkwall, Nikaila Berger, Maria Corrales Mendoza, Angel Palma, Jose Sosa Torres, Guadalupe Herrera, 
Luna Marine Rodriguez, Brianna Rodriguez Aguilar, Miriam Soriano Rosales, Laura America Herrera, and Vanessa Ramirez. Congratulations, you may be seated. The title of magna cum laude goes to the individuals with high distinction. Each of these members of the class of 2022 have earned a cumulative GPA above 4.0, which indicates excellence with college, honors, and or AP courses, in addition to the typical high school graduation requirements. Congratulations to our magna cum laude honorees who will stand as their names are called. Graduating magna cum laude, uh, Fatima Fierros Espinosa, <laughs> Javier Cornelio Torres, Marco Martinez Reyes, <laughs> Yahida Lopez, Jade Kennedy, Myra Brasenio Ortiz, Tu Jaw, Alejandro Gutierrez Hernandez, Mauricio Bonell, Jose Leva de Santiago, Ashwag Hersey. Congratulations, you may be seated. The title of summa cum laude is the highest scholastic honor and is reserved for the individuals whose academic performance has been the greatest. Congratulations to our summa cum laude honorees who will stand as their names are called. Graduating summa cum laude is class of 2022 salutatorian Maria Duran Garcia, graduating with a cumulative GPA of 4.4. And with a cumulative grade point average of 4.5, of class of 2022 valedictorian, Jimena Martinez Del Angel. Congratulations, you may be seated. The mission of Wyandotte High School is to educate, empower, and encourage all learners that they may create a better tomorrow for themselves and for our community. The class of 2022 is a special group of young men and young women. As you heard, the class of 2022 has already earned over $70 million in scholarships and have already earned 3,146 college credits. Those numbers top any previous class from Wyandotte High School. La clase del 2022 ganó más de 70 millones de dólares en becas universitarias y ya obtuvo 3,146 créditos universitarios. One hundred forty-five of these graduates are graduating Diploma Plus, which means that on top of meeting their high school requirements, they are graduating with an advantage of one or more of the following, 18 or more college credits, a 21 or higher on the ACT, an internship experience, an industry-approved project completion, an industry certificate, and or military service commitment. 145 miembros de esta clase se están graduando con el honor de Diploma Plus. In addition, well over half of these graduates are either fluent or have a strong command of more than one language. That provides an additional advantage in our world today. Mucho más de la mitad de los graduados hablan con fluidez o dominan más de un idioma. Esto es un gran ventaja en el mundo actual. And it is my honor to recognize five members of the class of 2022 
who are not only graduating with their high school diploma, but have also earned an associate's degree from the Kansas City, Kansas Community College. Cinco miembros de la clase del 2022 se están graduando con su diploma de la preparatoria y con un título de asociado del Colegio Comunitario de Kansas City, Kansas al mismo tiempo. Please stand as your name is called to be recognized. Mauricio Bernal. Javier Cornelio Torres. Maria Duran Garcia. Guadalupe Herrera. And Jimena Martinez de Angel. What an accomplishment. Congratulations. You may be seated. Class of 2022, it really is pretty phenomenal that you all came together as the Wyandotte class of 2022. Because members of this class were born in 19 different countries from around the world and in states from all across America. And yet, all of you arrived at Wyandotte High School in Kansas City, Kansas to come together as one class. Despite a pandemic that tried to separate you, you have helped each other come become better people. You have helped each other be here today. You have worked together celebrating uniquenesses and differences and recognizing the strength and power of diversity. You have experienced what it means to have a team around you. Use that example to remember to always have a team of supporters, confidants, mentors, and advisors around you. Don't try to do it alone. The challenges you faced as you work to stay focused, recover from adversity, and continue to fight for your goals and dreams are at a different level than many classes and even many generations have faced. And yet, you rose to the occasion, faced the challenges, and came out as a class with accomplishments that surpass any class from Wyandotte High School. You must know that so many qualities needed for success in life such as perseverance, overcoming adversity, and cross-cultural collaboration have been a part of your experience. When we say Diploma Plus, we mean graduating with an advantage. Each of you is graduating with these advantages tonight. And that's what you have to remember. You have to, what it takes. You have what it takes to make it through. You are a resilient bulldog. Our world needs you now. We need you more than ever. This is your new beginning. You will be the doctors, lawyers, caregivers, businessmen and women, and leaders of tomorrow. You already know that life is not always going to take the path that you had originally planned. But with your eye continually on the destination and a support team around you, your goals and your dreams are yours to make reality. So be a fierce bulldog. Don't let go of your goals and dreams. No matter what life throws at you, adjust and keep going. Create solutions. And finally, wherever you are, remember that your Wyandotte family loves you and is a true supporter of you always. Remember, it's always a great day to be a bulldog. And once a bulldog, always a bulldog. Wyandotte forever. Dr. Wynn and Dr. Stubblefield, 302 members of Wyandotte High School's 2022 senior class have successfully completed all curricular requirements mandated by the State of Kansas and Unified School District Number 500, Kansas City, Kansas. It is therefore an honor and a privilege for me to present them to you now for the official conferral of their diplomas. The Wyandotte High School Class of 2022, please stand.
Hey, you gotta enjoy it. It's your day. It is your night. Enjoy it. I, like everyone else, must congratulate you and congratulate your family, because you know they're a lot happier than you are that you've graduated, but you are too. Having successfully completed all curricular requirements mandated by the state of Kansas and the Unified School District number 500, Kansas City, Kansas, I, Dr. Valdinia Wynn, on behalf of the Board of Education do hereby confer upon you this diploma which designates you now and hereafter as a graduate, as a graduate of Kansas City, Kansas Public Schools. Give yourself a hand. I invite you to, graduates, you may be seated. I invite you to open your program to the next to last page. On the acknowledgement page is the following statement. We appreciate your sharing this special time in our lives and respectfully request that the audience refrain from excessively loud forms of expression during the presentation of diplomas. We want our names heard clearly. Thank you, the class of 2022. Please respect the class of 2022's wishes that their name and their accomplishments can be heard. After all diplomas have been conferred, we will give you an opportunity to join in a final enthusiastic salute to all graduates. Por favor, respete el deseo de la clase del 2022 y evite formas de expresión excesivamente fuertes durante la presentación de diplomas para que se escuchen los nombres y logros de cada estudiante. Después de que se hayan otorgado todos los diplomas, les daremos la oportunidad de unirse a un último saludo entusiasmado para todos nuestros graduados. Now, before the reading of the first name, we ask for a moment of silence for members of the class of 2022 that have died and are not physically with us today. We pause in loving memory of those classmates we have lost to violence in our community. Antes de la lectura del primer nombre, pedimos un momento de silencio para todos los miembros de la clase del 2022 que han fallecido y no están físicamente con nosotros hoy. Hacemos esta pausa en memoria amorosa de esos compañeros que hemos perdido a causa de la violencia en nuestra comunidad. Thank you. We also invite you to turn to the last page of tonight's program to take the pledge to work to curb the violence going on in the streets of Kansas City, Kansas, and to take the stand of enough is enough. También lo invitamos a pasar a la última página del programa de esta noche para comprometerse a trabajar para frenar la violencia que está ocurriendo en las calles de Kansas City, Kansas, y tomar la posición de ya basta. And at this time, Mr. Salvador Gavalda, Mrs. Leslie Hanzelka, and Mrs. Carmen Lajam will administer the final roll call for the Wyandotte High School class of 2022. Graduating Diploma Plus with 61 college credit hours, a KCKCC associate's degree, and an ACT score of 21 or higher, Jimena Martinez del Angel. Graduating Diploma Plus with 61 college credit hours, a KCKCC associate's degree, and a work key certificate silver level, Maria Duran Garcia. Graduating Diploma Plus with 41 college credit hours, work key certificate silver level, and an ACT score of 21 or higher, Fatima Fierros Espinosa. Graduating Diploma Plus with 62 college credit hours, a KCKCC associate's degree, and a work key certificate gold level, Javier Cornelio Torres. 
graduating Diploma Plus with 26 college credit hours and a work key certificate, bronze level, completion of an industry recognized civic engagement series project in the Learning Club Internship, Jahaira Mireya Lopez. Graduating Diploma Plus with 30 college credit hours, a Google certification, Cerner internship, and a project lead and the way AP credential in computer science and work key certificate platinum level. Marco Aurelio Martinez Reyes. Graduating Diploma Plus with 54 college credit hours and a work key certificate bronze level, Jade Jonay Kennedy. Graduating Diploma Plus with 43 college credit hours, a medical assistant CNA certification, work key certificate bronze level, and the Learning Club internship, Mayra Noemi Briseño Ortiz. Graduating Diploma Plus with 30 college credit hours, Tu Te Ja. Graduating Diploma Plus with 54 college credit hours and a work key certificate gold level, Alejandro Gutierrez Hernandez. Graduating Diploma Plus with 62 college credit hours, a KCK associate's degree, and an ACT score of 21 or higher, Mauricio Bernal. Graduating with high school requirements and 13 college credit hours, Jose Andres Leva de Santiago. Graduating Diploma Plus with 68 college credit hours, a medical assistant certification, and a work key certificate bronze level, Ashwa Hersey. Graduating Diploma Plus with 14 college credit hours, a work key certificate silver level, BizFest training, and completion of an industry recognized civic engagement series project, Judith Diaz Zaragoza. Graduating Diploma Plus with 60 college credit hours, a medical assistant certification, and a work key certificate bronze level. Parmesha Pokwal. <laughs> Graduating Diploma Plus with 19 college credit hours, Nakaila K. Berger. Graduating with high school requirements, Maria Inez Corrales Mendoza. Graduating Diploma Plus with 36 college credit hours, Ankel Gonzalo Palma Pules. Graduating Diploma Plus with 35 college credit hours and an electrical technology certification, Jose Sosa Torres. Graduating Diploma Plus with 69 college credit hours, a KCKCC associate's degree, work key certification bronze level, and of the Learning Club internship, Guadalupe Carolina Herrera. Graduating Diploma Plus with 21 college credit hours, work key certificate, platinum level, completion of an industry recognized civic engagement series project, and a student law academy internship. Luna Marin Rodriguez. Graduating with high school requirements, Miriam Soriano Rosales. Graduating Diploma Plus with 68 college credit hours, a medical assistant CNA certification, a work key certificate, silver level. Brianna Rodriguez Aguilar. Graduating with high school requirements, Laura Camila America Herrera. Graduating Diploma Plus with 16 college credit hours and a work key certificate silver level, Vanessa Corona Ramirez. Graduation, graduating with high school requirements, Amina Abdi. Graduating Diploma Plus with a Learner Club Internship, Hawa Abdi. <laughs> Graduating with high school requirements, Luis Abonce Rodriguez. <laughs> Graduating Diploma Plus with 54 college credit hours and a cosmetology certification, Jexy Lisette. <laughs> Graduating Diploma Plus with 16 college credit hours and a work key certificate bronze level, Alondra Jasmine Aguilar Gonzalez. Yeah, Graduating Diploma Plus with 36 college credit hours, a work key certificate silver level, a culinary arts certification, and serve safe certi certification, Luis Angel Aguilera Fernandez. <laughs> Graduating with high school requirements, Brian Elenilson Alvarenga. 
graduating Diploma Plus with 54 college credit hours, a construction certification, and OSHA certification, Alexis Angeles Martinez. Graduating Diploma Plus with 18 college credit hours, a construction certification, and an OSA certification, Carlos Humberto Argueta. Graduating with high school requirements, Margie Arita Moreira. Graduating with high school requirements, Marshall Deontay Ashley. Graduating Diploma Plus with the Work Key Certificate Bronze Level, Pedro Alexander Avila Lara. Graduating with high school requirements, Alfonso Ayala Galvan. Graduating Diploma Plus with 29 college credit hours and a nail technology certification, Ayana Alexandra Bab. Graduating with high school requirements, Brianna Monet Quinte Bailey. Graduating with high school requirements, Lene Ario Banks. Graduating Diploma Plus with 10 college credit hours, a work key certificate, silver level, and Adobe Photoshop certification, Amy Banduelos. <laughs> Graduating with high school requirements, Bonisha Barelli. Graduating Diploma Plus with 27 college credit hours and an office assistant certification, Jennifer Nicole Betancourt Flores. Graduating Diploma Plus with the Work Key Certificate Bronze Level, Jasmine Bilbao Hernandez. <laughs> Graduating Diploma Plus with five college credit hours and a Work Key Certificate Bronze Level, Pranita Biswa. <laughs> Graduating Diploma Plus with 61 college credit hours, a Medical Assistant Certification, a Work Key Certificate Silver Level, and a The Learning Club Internship, Chaviata Biswa. Graduating Diploma Plus with 21 college credit hours, a health career certificate, and a work key certificate silver level, Julissa Bolivar Rivera. <laughs> Graduating with high school requirements, Anaya Ray Brand. <laughs> Graduating Diploma Plus with three college credit hours and a Cerner internship, Juan Carlos Briseño. Graduating Diploma Plus with a Work Key Certificate Bronze Level, Heaven Loray Brooks. Graduating with high school requirements, Alicia Janae Bush. Graduating Diploma Plus with the completion of an industry recognized civic engagement series project, Sydney Nicole Byers. Graduating with high school requirements, Ulisa Araceli Campos. Graduating with high school requirements, Edward Enrique Cadenas Aguayo. Graduating Diploma Plus with a Work Key Certificate Bronze Level, an industry recognized civic engagement series project, and the Learning Club Internship, Osvaldo Manuel Carmona. Graduating Diploma Plus with the 40 college career or college credit hours, a culinary arts certificate, and a surf safe certified Armani Nicole Carr. Graduating with high school requirements, Sebastian Carete Arellanes. Graduating with high school requirements, Jonathan Jair Casilla Zapata. Graduating Diploma Plus with 54 college credit hours, a construction certification and OSHA certification, Carlos Samuel Castro de Santiago. Graduating Diploma Plus with the Work Key Certificate Bronze Level in an Industry Recognized Civic Engagement Series Project, Karina Silvia Chacon. Graduating with high school requirements, Navea Simone Chapman. Graduating Diploma Plus with a Work Key Certificate Bronze Level, Adrian Alejandro Chavez Rivera. Graduating with high school requirements, Kobe Nicholson. Graduating with high school requirements, Annika Yvette Colding. Graduating Diploma Plus with three college credit hours and a Cerner internship, Stephen Emerson Cole. 
Graduating Diploma Plus with a Work Key Certificate Bronze Level, Cesar Contreras. Graduating with High School Requirements, Pamela Contreras Cardea. Graduating with High School Requirements, Essen Yvonne Crook. Graduating Diploma Plus with 41 college credit hours, a cosmetology certificate, and a work key certificate bronze level, Sarita Cordova Duran. Graduating with high school requirements, Jailene Ariana Coronado. Graduating Diploma Plus with eight college credit hours and a work key certificate bronze level, Amaria Janai Crosby. Graduating with high school requirements, Amy Joanna Cruz. Graduating with high school requirements, Jasmine Cruz Hernandez. Graduating with high school requirements, Michael Sean Daniels. Graduating with high school requirements, Chandra Maya Darji. Graduating with high school requirements in five college credit hours, Rebecca Marie Davis. Graduating Diploma Plus with the Worky Certificate Bronze Level Adobe Photoshop Certification and an industry recognized civic engagement series project, Leslie Zitlali de Santiago. Graduating with high school requirements, Patriana Shanice Dockery. Graduating with high school requirements, Emilio Dominguez. Graduating with high school requirements and a five college credit hour, Britton Drew. Graduating Diploma Plus with 19 college credit hours, Ivion Dupree. Graduating with high school requirements, Armando Escobar Lira. Graduating Diploma Plus with 17 college credit hours and electrical certification and OSHA certification, Sergio Escobar Lira. Graduating with high school requirements, Lorenzo Anthony Escobedo Pena. Graduating Diploma Plus with a work key certificate bronze level, Lizelle Lamont Evans. Graduating with high school requirements, Stacy Figueroa. Graduating with high school requirements, Kendall Fisher. Graduating Diploma Plus with 31 college credits and a building engineering certification and an OSHA certificate, Emmanuel Abdias Flores. Graduating with high school requirements, Ashley Diana Flores. Graduating Diploma Plus with 18 college credit hours, an HVAC certificate, and OSHA certification, Jackson Omar Forgas Carvajal. Graduating Diploma Plus with 12 college credit hours and a working certificate gold level, Esli Nagai Franco Morales. Graduating Diploma Plus with 56 college credit hours and a medical assistance certificate, Cameron Marie Frazier. Graduating with high school requirements, Celia Fuentes. Graduating with high school requirements, Terrian Xavier Fung. Graduating with high school requirements and 16 college credit hours, Jocelyn Dayani Gachuz. Graduating with high school requirements, Kimberly Gandara. Graduating Diploma Plus with 54 college credit hours, construction certification, and an OSHA certification, Gerard Daniel Garcia. Graduating with high school requirements, Margarita Garcia Ortega. Graduating Diploma Plus with 15 college credit hours and a work key certificate bronze level, Laura Yesenia Garcia Tagle. Graduating with high school requirements, Kaylin Dawan Gar Garrison. Graduating with high school requirements, Joel Trinidad Gaitan. 
Graduating Diploma Plus with five college credit hours and a work key certificate bronze level, Muna Gimere. Graduating with high school requirements, Rina del Carmen Gil Peñate. Graduating with high school requirements, Mia Vanessa Gill. Graduating Diploma Plus with 30 college credit hours, a medical assistant certificate, and a work key certificate bronze level, Vera Lee Gomez Villegas. Graduating with high school requirements, Alia Snow. Graduating Diploma Plus with a Work Key Certificate Bronze Level, Victor Edmund Gross. <laughs> Graduating with High School Requirements, Somit Gurung. <laughs> Graduating Diploma Plus with the Learning Club Internship, Sostika Gurung. <laughs> Graduating with High School Requirements, Andrea Gutierrez Alvarez. Graduating Diploma Plus with a Work Key Certificate Bronze Level, Karen Guadalupe Gutierrez Oliva. Graduating Diploma Plus with 11 college credit hours and a CERNA internship, Anthony Guzman Renteria. Graduating with high school requirements, Michaela Shailin Hall. Graduating with high school requirements, Melanie Rose Hansen. Graduating with high school requirements, Shadow Virginia Hansen. Graduating Diploma Plus with the completion of an industry recognized civic engagement series project, J. Marcus Renai Harrison. Graduating with high school requirements, Aaron Abdon Hernandez. Graduating Diploma Plus with 44 college credit hours and an electrical certification, Moises Hernandez. Graduating with high school requirements, Yadira Hernandez. <laughs> Graduating Diploma Plus with 13 college credit hours and a work key certificate, Silver Level, Juliana Jacqueline Hernandez. <laughs> Graduating with high school requirements, Chris Hernandez Arita. Graduating with high school requirements, Angel Esteban Hernandez Flores. Graduating Diploma Plus with a Work Key Certificate Bronze Level, Denelson Eduardo Hernandez Herrera. Graduating with high school requirements, Robert John Hill. Graduating with high school requirements, Ashanti Shanae Hill. Graduating with high school requirements, Elisha Hezekiah Abram Hollins Leonard. Graduating Diploma Plus with 29 college credit hours, an auto collision certificate, and a work key certificate bronze level, Julissa Isabel Ortelano Vasquez. Graduating Diploma Plus with a work key certificate bronze level, Carla Hurtado. Graduating with high school requirements, Vanessa Ibarra. <laughs> Graduating with high school requirements and a few college courses, Vanessa Ibarra. Graduating with high school requirements, Adarius Jean. Graduating with high school requirements, Samaj Lindell Jefferson. Graduating with high school requirements, Zainab Jelani. Graduating with high school requirements, Ruby Sol Shade Jimenez. Graduating with high school requirements, Jayon Arnes Johnson. Graduating with high school requirements, Eddie Lamont Johnson. Graduating with high school requirements, Jay Lee Priyana Johnson. Graduating with high school requirements, Demetrius Quincy Lee Jones. 
Graduating Diploma Plus with 11 college credit hours in a health career CNA certification, Erica Michelle Jones. Graduating Diploma Plus with 50 college credit hours and a cosmetology certification, Anaya Jones. Graduating Diploma Plus with 42 college credit hours, Automotive Technology Certificate, National Institute for Automotive Service Excellence, ASE Certificate, and a Maintenance and Light Repair Certificate, Kevin Juarez. Graduating with high school requirements, Fasila Cambambo. Graduating with high school requirements, Joshua Kanye Fu. Graduating Diploma Plus with 30 college credit hours and a medical assistant certificate, Meharet Kenna. Graduating with high school requirements, Tierra Kimbrough. Graduating with high school requirements, Annika Lyric King. Graduating Diploma Plus with 10 college credits and an automotive technology certification, Lou Le. Graduating with high school requirements, Jennifer Lagunes. Graduating Diploma Plus with the Work Key Certificate Silver Level, Daniela Laura Ramirez. Graduating with high school requirements, Diego Lares Vargas. Graduating with high school requirements, Tanavia Trinice Lavender. Graduating Diploma Plus with 16 college credit hours and a nail technology certificate, Kaylin Gabrielle Lachey Lee. Graduating Diploma Plus with 18 college credit hours and a work key certificate bronze level, A.D. Shaylin Lemos Portillo. Graduating Diploma Plus with a Work Key Certificate Bronze Level and a Learning Club Internship, Nasi Ling. Yeah. Graduating with high school requirements, Antonio Manuel Linares Smith. Graduating with high school requirements, Melanie Raylene Lopez. Graduating Diploma Plus with a Learning Club Internship, Mayrin Lopez Espino. Graduating Diploma Plus with three college credit hours and a Cerner Internship, Ankel or no, no, Lopez Nataren. Graduating Diploma Plus, Kimberly Lisbeth Lopez Padilla. Graduating with high school requirements, Kevin Jair Lopez Aragon. Graduating Diploma Plus with the Work Key Certificate Bronze Level, Biz Fest Training, and completion of an industry recognized civic engagement series project, Estrellita Lopez Franco. Graduating with high school requirements, BJ Luna. Graduating Diploma Plus with 29 college credit hours and a construction certificate, Abraham Madrigal Gallardo. Graduating with high school requirements, Teresa Yamilet Maganda Martinez. Graduating with high school requirements, Selena Maldonado Moreno. Graduating Diploma Plus with a Work Key Certificate Bronze Level, Brian Mamawa. Graduating with high school requirements, Kayshawn Alonzo Manning. Graduating with high school requirements, Jefferson Alexander Martinez. <laughs> Graduating Diploma Plus with a Work Key Certificate Bronze Level, Heidi and Natalie Martinez. Graduating Diploma Plus with 20 credit hours and a Building Engineering and Maintenance Certification, Pablo Samuel Martinez Solis. Graduating with high school requirements, Nomi Vansui Moy. 
graduating Diploma Plus with 43 college credit hours, a work key certificate gold level, the Learning Club internship, and an ACT score of 21 or higher, Lanaya Malinda Carson Mead. Graduating with high school requirements, Ariel Medina Munoz. Graduating with high school requirements, Bo May. Graduating Diploma Plus with 26 college credit hours, a health career certificate, and a work key certificate silver level, we may. Graduating Diploma Plus with the work key certificate bronze level, Jaslyn Natalie Mejia. Graduating Diploma Plus with the work key certificate bronze level, Susan Alejandra Melendez Alfaro. Graduating Diploma Plus with a Work Key Certificate Silver Level and the completion of an industry recognized civic engagement series project, Diana Melgar Salas. Graduating with high school requirements, Neri Itzel Mendoza. Graduating with high school requirements, Josie Michel. Graduating with high school requirements, Dorian James Mitchell. Graduating with high school requirements, Moses Percy. Graduating Diploma Plus, Jose Montelongo Serrano. Graduating with high school requirements, Scarlett Montes Guillén. Graduating with high school requirements and five college credit hours, Daniela Mora Herrera. <laughs> Graduating Diploma Plus with 14 college credit hours and a work key certificate bronze level, Johanna Nicole Moreno. Graduating with high school requirements, Joel Moreno Avelino. Graduating with high school requirements, Antoine Marie Morton. Graduating with high school requirements, Jamorian Labon Moy. Graduating Diploma Plus with a work key certificate gold level, Jorge Mungia. Graduating Diploma Plus with 44 college credit hours and an HVAC certification, Ricky Ricky Ricardo Munoz. Graduating with high school requirements, Jonathan Munoz Loiza. Graduating with high school requirements, Alexis Murgia Garcia. Graduating with high school requirements, Georgina Morguia Hernandez. Graduating with high school requirements, Abubakar Musa. Graduating with high school requirements, Natalina Nore Musa. Graduating Diploma Plus with 10 college credit hours, a work key certificate, bronze level, the Learning Club internship, and a health career certificate. Pa Si Na. Graduating with high school requirements, Arlet Najera. Graduating Diploma Plus with a work key certificate, bronze level, Rachel Namahoro. Graduating Diploma Plus with 54 college credit hours and a medical assistant certificate, Lanaya Lachey New Mill. Graduating Diploma Plus with the Work Key Certificate Bronze Level and completion of an industry recognized civic engagement series project, Kasai, Paulette, and Jeru. Graduating Diploma Plus with 15 college credit hours and a cosmetology certificate, Leslie Joanna Norris Contreras. Graduating with high school requirements, Jorge Alonso Olano Mercado. Graduating with high school requirements, Sa Ne U. 
graduating Diploma Plus with 30 college credit hours, Angelicia Marcela Orozco. Graduating with high school requirements, Victor Emanuel Ortega. Graduating Diploma Plus with the Work Key Certificate Silver Level, Natalie Marie Ubri. Graduating with high school requirements and 13 college credit hours, Denise Pacheco Padilla. Graduating Diploma Plus with 10 college credit hours, a working certificate, silver level, Adriana Michelle Padilla Molina. Graduating with high school requirements, Regina Pantoja. Graduating Diploma Plus with 40 college credit hours, a work key certificate bronze level, OSHA certificate, building engineering and maintenance certificate, and a building and property management certificate, Luis David Pardo. Graduating Diploma Plus with a work key certificate bronze level, David Shea Pe. Graduating Diploma Plus with the Work Key Certificate Silver Level, Vanessa Perez Cruz. Graduating Diploma Plus with 26 college credit hours, an auto technology certificate, and a Work Key Certificate Bronze Level, Jesus David Pereira. Graduating Diploma Plus with the Work Key Certificate Bronze Level, Annie Pilevon. Graduating Diploma Plus with completion of an industry-recognized civic engagement series project, Cesar Mauricio Pinto Rodriguez. Graduating with high school requirements, Diego Eduardo Pizarro. Graduating with high school requirements, Suzanne Pokrell. Graduating with high school requirements, Jaslyn Marie Ramirez. Graduating Diploma Plus with 36 college credit hours and an HVAC certification, Jose Alexandro Ramirez Ayala. Graduating Diploma Plus with 42 college credit hours, automotive technology certification, National Institute for Automotive Service Excellence, ASC certificate, and a maintenance and light repair certificate, Edwin Ivan Ramos. Graduating with high school requirements, Miguel Angel Ramos Herrera. Graduating with high school requirements, Sudeep Raisali. Graduating Diploma Plus with 17 college credit hours, work key certificate, silver level, completion of an industry recognized civic engagement series project, Alcott Arts Center internship and a student law academy internship. Ivan Elizabeth Razo Alatore. Graduating with high school requirements, Co Ray. Graduating Diploma Plus with 16 college credit hours and a work key certificate bronze level, Michelle Estefani Resendez Flores. Graduating with high school requirements, Diana Isabel Reyes Rodriguez. Graduating Diploma Plus with five college credit hours, a work key certificate, silver level, and an early childhood certification, Diamond Marie Rios. Graduating Diploma Plus with 19 college credit hours, enlistment to the Marine Corps and an auto collision repair certification, Jonathan Darren Ricks McSty. Graduating Diploma Plus with 34 college credit hours, a construction certification and an OSHA certification, Adrian Ulises Rodriguez. Graduating with high school requirements, Cynthia Arelli Rodriguez. Graduating with high school requirements, Erika Rodriguez. Graduating Diploma Plus with an Adobe Photoshop certification and a Youth Entrepreneurship Challenge, Jose Luis Rodriguez Lopez. 
graduating with high school requirements, Marari Rodriguez Ramirez. Graduating with high school requirements, Joanna Guadalupe Rodriguez Pacheco. Graduating with high school requirements, America Joanna Rodriguez Torres. Graduating with high school requirements, Anthony Rodriguez Vital. Graduating with high school requirements, Rodolfo Ro Roman Arrellano. Graduating Diploma Plus with 65 college credit hours and a medical assistant certification, Nayeli Rosales. Graduating with high school requirements, Diamaya Rucker. Graduating Diploma Plus with 42 college credit hours and Automotive Technology Certificate, National Institute for Automotive Service Excellence Certificate, and a Maintenance and Light Repair Certificate, Giovanni Ruiz. Graduating Diploma Plus with 42 college credit hours and Automotive Technology Certificate, National Institute for Automotive Service Excellence, ASE Certificate, and a Maintenance and Light Repair Certificate, Ulises Ruiz. Graduating with high school requirements, Shavion Nicole Russell. Graduating with high school requirements and three college credit hours, Susie Lisbeth Sandoval. Graduating with high school requirements, Montserrat Santillan Castro. Graduating Diploma Plus with 25 college credit hours and a medical assistant certificate, Esperanza Cristal Maria Santoyo. Graduating with high school requirements, Elmer Giovanni Santos Lara. Graduating with high school requirements, Lade Michelle Saunders. Graduating Diploma Plus with 16 college credit hours and a work use certificate gold level, Ta Sayin. <laughs> Graduating Diploma Plus with 42 college credit hours and automotive technology certificate, National Institute for Automotive Service Excellence certificate, and a maintenance and light repair certificate, Carlos Elian Sepulveda Varela. Graduating Diploma Plus with five college credit hours and a work key certificate silver level, Karina Cimental. Graduating with high school requirements, Japiti Singranayo. Graduating Diploma Plus with 10 college credit hours, a building engineering certification, OSHA certification, Ramon Deche Smith Jr. Graduating with high school requirements, Jameer M. Smith. Graduating Diploma Plus with 23 college credit hours and a work key certificate bronze level, Shamir S. Smith. Graduating with high school requirements, Jair Soto Jimenez. Graduating with high school requirements, Leonel Arturo Suarez. Graduating with high school requirements, Juan Tapia. Graduating with high school requirements, Alan Tapia Guerra. Graduating Diploma Plus with completion of an industry recognized civic engagement series project and learning club internship. Medium Lizeth Tenorio Solorio. Graduating with high school requirements, Rayana Nicole Thurman. Graduating with high school requirements, Cassandra Tovar Frias. Graduating Diploma Plus with 55 college credit hours, a culinary arts certificate, health career certificate, 
Surf Safe Certificate in Learning Club Internship, Rebecca Tumisafu. Graduating Diploma Plus with the Worky Certificate Bronze Level, Robert LaShawn Union. Graduating Diploma Plus with the Worky Certificate Bronze Level, Brian Jesus Uvina Valenzuela. Graduating with high school requirements, Jonathan Valencia Ortega. Graduating Diploma Plus with 53 college credit hours, a medical assistant certification, and a work key certificate bronze level, Cindy Valenzuela. Graduating Diploma Plus with 15 college credit hours, a health career CNA certificate, and a work key certificate silver level, Ulisa Vale Barraza. Graduating with high school requirements, Juan Maciel Vasquez Otiveros. Graduating with high school requirements, Soseas Velo. Graduating Diploma Plus with five college credit hours, a working certificate, gold level, Cristina Villafuerte. Graduating Diploma Plus with 42 college credit hours, automotive technology certificate, National Institute for Automotive Service Excellence Certificate and a Maintenance and Light Repair Certificate, Manuel Villalpando. Graduating with high school requirements, Manuel Villeda. Graduating Diploma Plus with 19 college credit hours and a work key certificate bronze level, Andrea Villegas Chavira. Graduating with high school requirements, Hamida Kirana Wahid. Graduating with high school requirements, Kennedy Renee Walker. <laughs> Graduating Diploma Plus with 10 college credit hours, a working certificate bronze level, and a Kansas Personal Finance Challenge, Cadence Michelle Elizabeth Washington. Graduating with high school requirements, Faisal Welly. Graduating with high school requirements, Mohammed Williams. Graduating Diploma Plus with the Worky Certificate Bronze Level, Adrell Williams. Graduating with high school requirements, Taylor Wilson. Graduating Diploma Plus with 47 college credit hours, an automotive technology certificate, National Institute for Automotive Service Excellence certificate, and a maintenance and light repair certificate, Angel Gabriel Saldivar Hernandez. Graduating Diploma Plus with the working certificate bronze level, Brenda Diani Zavala. Graduating with high school requirements, Franklin Neil Van Beber. <laughs> Graduating Diploma Plus with 37 college credit hours, a construction certificate, and an OSHA certification, Manuel Fernando Vasquez. Graduating with high school requirements, Elizabeth Inez Vasquez. Graduating Diploma Plus with the Work Key Certificate Gold Level, Oliver Gabriel Vasquez Bilbao. Graduating with high school requirements, Raman Murrell. Graduating with high school requirements and nine college credit hours, Darwin Acosta. Graduating with high school requirements, Jayla Treshawn Adams. Will the Wyandotte High School, class of 2020, please stand.
place, place your castle to the left. Place your tassels to the left because you are now officially graduates of Wyandotte High School. Please process out to receive your diplomas.